accepting the payment document for processing. 427. What steps does the court take in processing a payment? Processing a payment to the contractor involves the following steps. 1. Determining if payment may be processed. 2. Inspecting the payment document for completeness. 3. Accepting the invoice or notifying the contractor of any defects found in an invoice. 1. Determining if payment can be processed. Prior to processing any payments, at least one of the following must be true. Acceptance of the product or service must have occurred. Contract performance must have been otherwise completed. Several documents may need to be obtained in order to determine whether payment can be processed. Necessary documentation may include Documentation that supports successful delivery or completion of products and services, including Inspection forms Receiving report forms, see Question 311, Chapter 6 Commercial shipping documents Packing lists Documentation of the suspension of performance Documentation of the application of remedies such as liquidated damages or rejection of work. Documentation of adjustments to liquidation rates or reductions in progress payments. Documentation of interim or final adjustments to the contract price. Modifications to the contract. Documentation of termination settlements. 2. Inspecting the payment document for completeness. Once a contractor submits an invoice for payment, the Corps may be required to Inspect the submitted invoices Determine if the invoice is complete Determine if the invoice is for a fixed price or cost type contract 3. Accepting the invoice or notifying the contractor of any defects found in the invoice Once an invoice is received the Corps will evaluate the invoice and either accept it or notify the contractor of a deficiency in the invoice. Incomplete or incorrect invoices should be returned to the contractor prior to acceptance for payment. Contractors must be notified of any specific deficiencies. In writing and Within seven calendar days after the receipt of invoice If the contractor submits an incomplete invoice, the Corps should keep a record of the length of the delay getting a corrected invoice from the contractor causes. Once the invoice is corrected, if the original invoice date appears on the corrected invoice, the invoice should be sent to the payment office with the following statement. After receipt of invoice, the contracting office waited days for the contractor to supply necessary information for invoicing. Therefore, the invoice was not proper until and any interest payment that may be due the contractor shall be based on this later date.